what is the gospel? The word gospel means good news, but you can't have good news unless you have bad news. And the bad news is everywhere. Lying, cheating, stealing, hating, arguing, bias, misery, unforgiveness. I mean, the Bible calls all those things sin, and when you look out in this world, they're everywhere. And it's not just out there in this world. The problem with sin is that it's in me, and it's in you. But there's good news. There's a remedy for sin. This is good news. All you have to do is be perfect every minute of every day of every year of your life, and then you're good. Sounds easy, right? <laughs> of course not. None of us can do it. We've all sinned. We've all fallen short of the glory of God. We've all hated. We've all lied. We've all cheated. We've all stolen. We've all envied, and we've all done a whole bunch of sins. But the gospel is good news. God's plan was beautiful. Instead of having us pay the price for our sins, even though we're the ones who broke this world, he sent his son Jesus into this world to die for our sins in our place. Every sin was paid for. Jesus did that for you, and he did that for me. And now, by grace, as a gift, through faith, we receive that salvation by repenting of our sins, turning to Jesus, and trusting in the good news that Jesus did for you what you could not do for yourself because he loved you first. Will you repent and will you trust in Jesus? He'll redeem you. He'll give you eternal life. He loves you forever. If you have any questions about it, let us know. We want to help you trust in Jesus today. It's good news. God bless you.